First fish. Yes! Yeah, we got some real nice riverbed through here. Got nice trees and cliffs up there. The river's just over there, just trickling. But yeah, it's real nice walking, pretty easy. Nice weather too, beautiful weather. It's currently um, Good Friday, Easter long weekend, 2024. A few roos over there. Welcome back to another outdoorsy video. Back out in the Aussie bush, fishing for some cod and doing something a little bit different this time. Actually camping out, like doing a hike and camp sort of um, trip this time, just an overnighter. Um, yeah, see how it goes. We've actually got some company on this trip. There's my lovely girlfriend back. Hello. Hello. Anyway, yeah, let's see how we go. We've already hiked down the river about five, six k's. Just trying to find a campsite at the moment. Uh, it's pretty late in the afternoon. So yeah, anyway, let's get fishing. First fish. Do you want to hold that? Mm -hmm. Got him? Yep. First little fish of the trip. Nice little cod on the Sioux Witch. It's been what? Half an hour. I've only just like been throwing some random casts in the in the pools. Yeah, nice. Anyway, we're getting back. Hopefully a bigger one. You mm -hmm. frothing. That's where I lost my lure back. Where? Just straight in front of you. See that log is down there? Yeah. In the water? Oh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Did you see that? That was awesome. He followed out under here. I had a little hit right there and I saw him swim up here and I just took it over here and he's nailed it. That was awesome. Just another little one. That's two in 10 minutes, nine minutes. A nice little one, pretty similar size actually. The last one. Yeah, that was an epic little eat though. Anyway, let's get him back. That's the second one in 10 minutes. See you, mate. You frothing. Oh, yep. Oh, no. No. That's a better one. Got another one. Here's a bit of a better one than this morning. Earlier this morning anyway. I had a follow from a big one down there. But yeah, he didn't come back. Just swapped over to the 
orgy plough in the 90 mil. Something a little bit different. All right, that's number three for the for the morning. Yeah, a bit of a better one. Just in this little pool, had a big follow before, but unfortunately, no hookups. But we're getting back. See you later, mate. Off he goes. You frothing. Right where I was, right where that bus stop was. Can you grab my lip grips out of there, please, Beck? That's the fourth one. It's just ticked over sort of lunchtime now. And um, yeah, just there was a, just a small little like sort of bust up on the water. As soon as I cast it out, two cranks of the handle, and boom, on. Anyway, we'll get him back. Nice one. Yes. You frothing. It's a big snake. Not too sure what it is. It's not a black snake, it's got a black head on it. You guys can see that. All right, here's a setup. This is the Big Agnes Copper Spur two person. Lightweight camping tent, biking, 1.3 kilo. There you go, that's the inside. That's my bed, there's Beck's bed. Got some food stored in there. Put our bags in here overnight in the, in the vestibule. But yeah, it's a nice little setup. Take you around this way and that's the view out. That'd be something nice waking up in the morning. Probably have a little fire pit down here, set up a little fire pit down there somewhere. We've got a beer down there cooling. Got a beer that's there cooling down. Anyway, I might go for a bit of a swim, cool off, and clean up a little bit. Phew, frothing. Alright, just got my um, silky gomboy. Saw, great little saw, I've actually never used it, it just folds away. Just chop some firewood. Alright, just gonna go throw a bit of top water. It's getting pretty late, it's currently 10 past 5 in the Arvo. Sun's going down here, so we're going down. Yeah, see how we go. Had a bit of a quiet afternoon. I only got that one in Savo. Um, yeah, it's been pretty quiet at the moment, but hopefully they turn on soon. Anyway, let's see how we go. You frothing. All right, just gonna have to filter some water because um, you can only carry about three liters each, and we knew we we're gonna need heaps more. So this is a Sawyer Squeeze filter. 
water filter. So he's got to fill this bag up, squeeze it through. Then I've also got some um, some tablets too to put in, just for a bit of extra extra security, I guess. Anyway, let's fill some water. Oh, yep, yes, on. Got a little one, he's tiny. That's not even a cod. I think that's a, um... All right, look at that. I've got no idea what this is. Is it a silver perch? I don't think it's a yellow belly. Anyway, yeah, let me know in the comments what you reckon this fish is. I've got no idea. Yeah, let us know. Anyway, we're getting back. It's not a carp. That fish was tiny. I went for this big lure. <laughs> Anyway, you frothin. Yes. Yes. That's what we're talking about. That is what we're talking about. Ah, oh, yes. Top water hits, baby. You. Oh, that scared me too. There we go, nice little top water cod. Yeah, like I was saying before, it's probably one of the nicer ones I've had this trip so far. One of the bigger ones. Look at that big mouth, look at him. All right, let's get him back. That was epic. You, you, frothing. Yes, that was so sick. That was so sick. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. That was awesome. Here's another nice one too. Look at that. Oh, nearly lost him. Look at that. That's awesome. That'd be 60. Much bigger than my last one, that last top water one. That was such a sick bite. All right, let's get him back straight away. You, mate, he came up to my feet like three times. That fourth one finally got him. You, frothing. Whoa. That was loose. <laughs> Far out. Big slip. Big slip on that rock. All right, just packed up camp. That's where the tent was. That's where the firepost was. Can't even tell we've been here. Anyway, we're gonna start heading back now. Do a fish a couple of holes in the way. 
Yes, here we go. Just nearly gonna record that too. Yeah, let's go skits. Just as we were saying, it's been pretty slow this morning. Yeah, just got a little yellow on the Sioux Witch too. Yeah, we'll get him back. He's off. Ew, frothing. Some big carp in there too. There's a fair bit of rock hopping in these parts. But at least it's not too difficult to walk along.